morning. Your one and only bird boy is back with a video. Today we're just going out west. Yep, easy as that. We're going over yonder. We're going over to the old freaking crown mine, the old Queen's land that we're gonna play on. So, got the truck started, in the truck now, ripping over to my friend's house, gonna pick him up. I brought a bunch of stuff, a shovel, I brought an ax, the essentials basically, you know. We're gonna go out and have some fun. See if we can maybe hunt some food, little little small game action. Or if not, I mean, hey, just have a good old time, drink some beer, be with a buddy. Step one complete at Buddy's house. Grabbing them, ripping over yonder to the bush. Oh yeah, bud. We made it. We are out in the west, in the crown land, into our thing. Gonna start a fire probably. <sighs> yeah, we'll start with that. Hashtag influencer. Well, fire's lit. Walking yonder, going for a ponder. And see if we can get some water out of the old river and not fall through and die. Got the ax, got myself, got a little water bottle. Camera won't do it justice. We're about almost knee deep snow here. I got some tall knees, I ain't your average fella. I don't got average knees, I got tall knees. It's a little steep. Ah, we're down. No chance of Reuben surviving. Big a hole the size of me in the water. We'll find it. We'll find water. Are you confident there, Baba? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, he says. Oh yeah. There's literally water. 70% of the earth is water. So that means something. Does the ice, ice shelf mean water? Maybe it means we're going to die. A bird nest. Nest. Oh. Is that just shiny ice or is that water? Oh. Oh. Well, I know it's thick. I shouldn't be scared. It's got like, we only got like 38 inches of ice here. Yeah, a little, a little creaky. <laughs> Found water down yonder. I'm gonna go get that. Hey, my bottle. Oh, I'm bear grills. Drink, Drink your piss. Drink your piss. Drink your piss, bear. Bear grills. Oh yeah. Just stay on the rocks is all. Oh yeah, that's cold. Just the way the fishy like it. Thought bringing this bottle would be a good idea because it's packable. <laughs> What's it doing? What's not doing is getting uh, yeah, water. Yeah, get like half of it. Half full. There we go. You gotta ask, are you like a yeah, glass half empty or a glass half full kind of guy? Shuffle, I think. What the crap? There we go. You really gotta make your open. You don't You don't need all your fingers. That's why God gives you 10 of them. You can lose like one or two. Yeah, he knows you're gonna experiment a little bit. Yeah. Well. Nice. I was standing on that. You know what that'll teach you? Something. You can stand on the ice. I don't know what it is. Something like that. Something eventually. All right, we got water. We got coffee. Water obtained. Fire. Down the bowl of the water. Make a coffee. Yeah, that works. I don't even know, maybe. Something like that. And that water will keep you going all day long. Dang. Drink some bottled water from the store. Not even maybe, old son. That stuff will go right through like it's not even there. Yeah in one hole out the other, if you know what I'm saying. He literally just has a no cell service oasis. There's a freaking, there's a hunting outfit that's like 20 kilometers away that does guided hunts for wolf, bear, like everything. But the best part is he has what's called a trips cabin. It's like the no frills one. Yeah. So he's got the bed and the wood stove. And that's pretty much it. He's got free range chickens. Like All right, we got sausage. That's completely frozen. We got fire. So we're gonna thaw the sausage on the fire. And hopefully, eventually cook it. But this is the old Bambi special. This is the old deer. What else did I put in here? Garlic. It's like a Ukrainian with cheddar. And that's what we're working with. You ready for that, Bubba? Look at that. The old Ukrainian cheddar. The old Ukrainian, the old beast from the <sighs> east cheddar. Might as well throw them all on there. I don't, I don't bring a pack and not cook a pack, you know what I'm saying? That'd be silly. Is that the deer you 
What's that? Is that the deer you shot? You betcha. Home deer? Oh yeah. Home home top bones. Right from the field over yonder. Oh, whoa! Hey. <laughs> right. What's going on here? She's just peeling my skin back. I'm like, there we go. Oh, that's a little a little hard on the old attack there on the old fire, but you know. Let's see if we can put that over yonder. Let it do its thing in the corner. They're still frozen. I don't want to burn the ends, like the the, the, the the surface of them. That might be a little warm. Nah, she'll be good, eh? Yeah, that skin there is just collagen. So she'll, she'll like burn off. Yeah, they pull the, what do they do they call them? They pull it out of the bone marrow or something. Yeah. However that works, or the ear lobes, you know, collagen sources. Like the, the toenails of the deer or something. Yeah, I take all the ear lobes off. And <laughs> Ooh. Nipples and stuff. Yeah, I will say the orange ginger tea. <laughs> it's kind of hit you. Oh, it's good. Nice. I like it. I like the way it is and stuff. Doesn't like tea in nature. Boom. We have sausages. They are done. Succulent, succulent pieces. Okay. Grab a sausage. Get all the char off it. I give her a cross section. Get the snow off my axe here. Nice man. It's all good. <laughs> oh, look at that laser beam. Oh yeah. Yeah. She's warm. I guess I could have told you these could have been eaten raw too. They were fully smoked. Oh really? But anyway. Good. Oh yeah. Oh, that's actually really good. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. That'll do. Uh, cheers, bud. Look at that, eh? Look, cheddar. Cheddar. Just burn my hand like here. It. Don't need a hand, actually. Overrated. First one I've had over a fire. It's not disappointing. You know, some will say you've made it when you have a lot of money or a big house or something. I'd say you made it when you drink beer with your homemade deer sausage over a fire in the middle of the bush. That's living right there. Oh yeah. Mmm. What is the story on the back? Dude? Yeah, it's quite a. The hot summer sun had nothing on this farmer's daughter. Everything. Every one of their beers has a little, you know, a little thing going on. She turned all the cowboys' heads at the local watering hole. The fear of daddy was enough to keep most of the boys away, but for the new hired hand, that only fanned his flame. It's a classic beer. It ain't a real man's beer until it has a weird story behind it, you know? Oh! Oh, geyser. Oh, geyser, care. Holy moly. Holy guac. I was making sausage one day, and I was like, don't have any. And I want cheese in this, but I'm not going to use, like, because if you use regular cheddar, it just ruins it. So I drove to Red Deer just for cheese. Drove back home. Oh. <laughs> I was like, I got to do it right. And it's worth it, I think. Well, this one's got a little, this one's got a little more crust to her. I'm going to give this one a little shave, I think. Crust is flavored. Sure. You know, shave my sausage. Some guys use a manscape. I use an axe. <laughs> this is this is real manscaping right here. Shaving your sausage with an axe. Oh yeah. We're gonna eat sausage, drink beer. Oh yeah. Well, like all great ideas, they start around a campfire after you've had a beer. So we've decided that. Since I couldn't get through the ice, we're not accepting defeat. And we are, in fact, going with the old shotgun to the ice to just pop a hole. We got bird shot. Might not work that great. Might work great. We'll see. So, see you at the ice. Give her by the river. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Safety first. Glasses are on. It's cooled down quite a bit. Look at that for free. Got the old... What do we got in here? First one, it's kind of a random. We got like all sorts of colors going on. So, first shot will be a blue one. Number five. We got five shot. Number, shot, number five. No five shot, boy. <laughs> Welcome to the freaking show, ladies and gentlemen. Well, we have not made it through 
<laughs> Round two. Are you through? Well, that also didn't make it through. I don't know if this is more efficient than the axe <laughs> or not. I felt it on my parts and stuff. Well, that's the thing. So what we do have is a whole lot of BBs. Starting to build my little crevasse down there. Look at that crevasse. Oh, crevasse. Look at in the cave. Look at the crack right there. But job ain't done. Keep on going. Being as I'm really shooting right into it now, there's a lot more pieces hitting me in the face. <laughs> That's not ideal. That's what the safeties are for. The crevasse deepens. See down there? Look at that. I don't know if that's rock or... There's something down there. I'll try one more. I think that might be rock. It might just be right ice in the middle. All right, we froze it up. I guess we'll try two more. Well, we've learned something today. This river's pretty frozen. <laughs> What's the final crevasse? I don't think we made it down all the way to the water. I do have some frosted tips on my fingers. And in Canada, about $300 worth of shotgun shells spent. So you can't win them all. But yeah, well, hope you enjoyed that show. That was something. <laughs> Goodness gracious. And just like that, it's dark outside drove on home well currently driving on home and that's gonna wrap up the day so I had a good old time out there gotta see buddy didn't want to film a whole whole lot because you know it's more about us just hanging out catching up on life all that kind of good stuff but got a couple things for you you know guns axe beer sausage it's kind of like my life can't ask for a whole lot more than that for me so I gave you what I could. I delivered what I could. Don't knock it. Don't knock it till you try it. Anyway, I'm going home now. We're about 38 seconds away from my dwelling. And then I'm gonna go in and edit this video. Posterizer for you boys and girls. And I will see you on the next one.